Lawmakers and survivors from Santa Fe, the site of last week's high school school shooting that killed 10 people, are in Austin. Governor Greg Abbott asked a lot of people from different backgrounds to join him for three days of roundtable discussions. The talks began with a focus on policy, but ended today with something far more emotional. The governor invited people not only from Santa Fe, but also victims of shootings in Sullivan Springs and Alpine, Texas. KXA and Steffi Lee is live at the Capitol with what they want to see. Steffi. Well, Sydney, the meeting is still happening right now. Abbott is speaking with other reporters, speaking with students, families, and a lot of what we heard today is they're asking for more mental health resources. One idea to start is that they want to give counselors more time to work with students face-to-face, one-on-one outside of the classroom. Now, reporters were allowed in for the last half hour of Thursday's meeting. Around 30 people were here from Santa Fe. Students told Abbott they're often on a wait list and it could take more than a week to see a counselor, whether for mental health needs or even schedule changes. One girl she said that she'd like to see random bag checks since students she knows sometimes carry things like pocket knives. They have also would like to see more police presence and a mass notification system. State Senator Larry Taylor represents Santa Fe and he says each school has different security needs. Whether it's wands or just having someone at the door, you know, they don't want their school to look like a prison, but we go to courthouses, we go to airports, we go through metal detectors. It's not, we don't feel like it's a prison, it's just a natural security concern that we have for the safety of everyone. Now, people from Santa Fe who have expertise in security notification systems say that schools that are a decade old or just just new schools have infrastructure systems that could work with a mass notification system. Now, one would be for a fire alarm. Another would be different, something for like an active shooter, for example. Now, they asked Abbott to, about getting a code to eventually make this happen. Back to you.